I would like to introduce myself. My name is Charles Spencer Chaplin. I am better known as Charlie Chaplin. I was born to a versatile vocalist and actor for a dad, and an actress and singer for a mom. Their names were Charles Spencer Chaplin Sr. and Hannah Chaplin. I was born on April 16th of 1889. I was 12 when my father died in St. Thomas Hospital in London of alcoholism. After the death of my father, sadly, my mom was in and out of mental institutions. After that, my half-brother Sydney and I were then put in a charity home after my mom went crazy. At a very young age, I was told that someday I would be the most famous person in the world. After that, it became a personal goal to reach for the stars. I was taught to sing and dance at a very young age. With my half-brother Sydney acting as my agent, I learned it my first dancing act in a play called Eight Lancashire Lads. At 10, I performed at the London Hippodrome, which made me one of the most popular child actors in all of England. I went to Hearns Boys College for two years. That was the only real education I ever received. After that, I was on the streets, all alone, by myself. During my time, Thomas Edison invented the nickel alkaline battery. Also, Mary Curie invented a marvelous thing. She invented nuclear energy. I won an Emmy for Best Actor at the 1973 Oscars. I also won an honorary award in 1972. I was not nominated for Best Actor in The Great Dictator in 1941. I'm a huge opponent of racism. In fact, all my helpings got me into trouble with the Federal Bureau of Investigation. They thought I was a communist. So when I flew to London for my premiere of Limelight, when I arrived back, I found out that I was kicked out of the US, never to return. Finally, they let me back in. I died on Christmas of 1977. Thank you for listening to my speech. Thank you. Thank you, and thank you.